Hello everybody, Flaming Shark back with another video, and this is the review for my blind commentary, blind reaction to season one, episodes five through seven of Amphibia. I don't know if this video is going to be going up on uh, Wednesday or Thursday because I don't know when I'm going to do the post the Ruby soundtrack. I just recorded, I recorded my Hero Academia, um, uh, the, the January third Shark talking here. Recorded my Hero Academia, and then. Just recorded Amphibia, and I'm still planning to also record the soundtrack before, for Ruby before I'm done for the night. Um, obviously, My Hero will be before Amphibia, but I don't know if I'll post the Ruby soundtrack on the the 4th, the 5th, or the 6th. So I, I don't know what day this will go up, but it'll either be uh, Wednesday or Thursday. Whichever day that you guys get this, I hope you guys are excited for some more... Uh, some more, uh, what's it called? Some more, um, lovely Amphibia. These were fun episodes. I honestly enjoyed all six of them. I thought they were all good. Um, again, you know, nothing too stand out from the show. I really enjoyed the very first episode, the set 5A. But, um, really fun. You know, I, I thought these episodes, you know, again, in a 22-minute format, I don't know... If the charm of the show would, would 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 hit as well, I think in the eleven minute format it's able to get away with it. But of course, in the twenty two minute format we'd have less episodes, so it'd be you know it just would be different. Like it's just a different two different animals. But um, I'm enjoying the show. I'm having fun with it. I'm not again. I don't have like these super high thoughts of it yet. But that's potentially for later. We'll we'll see what I think of the show when it starts to really you know ramp up. But. As far as just the fun nature of the kind of day-to-day -day episodes of the uh, of the world that we live in, um, it's, they've been pretty fun. I thought this set was certainly... Uh, I think I enjoyed this set more than the last one. Um, I think I enjoyed 5 to 7 more than 2 to 4. I don't think if that's, not, if that's because the episodes are getting better or because I'm starting to familiarize myself more with the series, adjust to it, get a feel for what it's going for, at least in its early episodes. And, um, but I do also think that these episodes were pretty strong for, uh, again, for what they were. I thought all six of them were fun. I thought they were all cool. I thought there was nice little messages, nice little bits of character development and fun stuff like that that I really appreciated. Obviously, links down below the reaction <laughs> on Mega and Vimeo when this video first goes up uh, in January 2022, but uh, it could be different down the line depending on when you see this. If you see this in the future and I have to change one or both of the links or whatever, you, you get the idea. Pretty simple. But uh, yeah, I'm really excited to get to more Amphibia, we're going to make it to the middle. We're going to make it through the first half of Season 1 in the next Amphibia video, which should be really cool. And I'm just generally excited to get deeper into this journey. You know, I'm starting to definitely get invested in, like, Sprig and Anne. I really like Hoppadaya, Hop Pop. Uh, Polly's cool. Like, those four core characters I'm, you know, really getting into, really starting to get invested into. And obviously that'll be cool for wherever this story goes later on um, when things start to ramp up and however they decide to. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm having fun with the show. I think it's been pretty cool so far. I'm definitely, definitely excited to be making some progress on that. And uh, just generally, like I said, I'm recording a lot of stuff, you know, getting ahead of my videos. Um, and um, I'm excited for that too. And like I said, I'm trying to have a daily, daily videos for all of January, you know, obviously with three non, um, non new content videos, one of which being the update video on January 1st and other having already passed as well being the re-upload on January 3rd. And if everything goes according to plan, my other re-upload uh, for the month won't be until January 30th. So, um, yeah, from January 4th to January 29th, so basically the whole month. From that stretch, I'm hoping to post nothing but new, like, reactions and Let's Play episodes and stuff like that. So, uh, hopefully it goes through and we have the perfect January that I've been planning. I think we're off to a really good start because, uh, like I said, I don't know if you guys will see this Wednesday or Thursday, but uh, on the 3rd, I will have recorded uh, Amphibia, My Hero, and, the, and Ruby. So, I'll have, a you know, already getting multiple days ahead because at that point, I guess I'd be 
I guess I'd be four days ahead because then I'd have you know Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then I have the Let's Play next Let's Play episode for Friday. So everything's like going well, and uh, hopefully I'll continue to be able to stay ahead the rest of the month and just keep being consistent moving forward. That's the goal. You know, 2021, I, I, I turned a corner with consistency. I reached a level of consistency that I really hadn't had in prior years. And 2022, I'm trying to take that to the next level and truly become through and through con uh, a consistent YouTuber all around. And that's, that's one of the main goals in 2022 is just to be as consistent as I can. Because uh, like I said, I think in the second half of 2021, I was a lot more consistent than I normally am, and now I want to take that to the next level and really be, you know, have a perfect month and maybe even more. You know, it'd be great, and that's that's what we're working towards. So hopefully everything works out. But um, don't really have anything else to say. But again, we'll we'll talk it out a few more minutes. Want to keep these videos? Don't want these videos to be too short. You know, don't want want to keep my YouTube overlords nice and happy. Or who knows, maybe one day these will be re-uploaded on a site that isn't YouTube. Who knows? Um, you never know, I suppose. But, um, yeah, I'm I'm excited for more Amphibia. It's uh, going pretty well. I think the show's quite charming. I like Anne a lot. Um, Sprig's pretty cool. Um, I already think I like Sprig a little more than I thought I would as far as just initial impressions. Uh, Polly's great. I really like Hot Pop. Hop Pop is maybe my favorite of the group. Um, I do really like Anne, though. I think Anne's quite interesting. And I think the more we start to get on Anne, the more I like I like her nuances. That I, we're, like, I'm already starting to see some of her nuance. Because uh, in this set, we got to see that she's, in fact, a bit more feminine than I feel like, you know, feminine than, than she's come off in prior to this, which I think is a cool wrinkle. And, you know, just various things that the more we kind of get of Anne, the more interested... Um, I am in her, and I've really liked her from the start. I really love her voice, um, and I really, re I'm vi I vibe with Anne. Like Anne's really cool, so I really like her as a protagonist, and uh, I'm enjoying what the other three bring: Polly Sprig and um, Hot Pop. So yeah, it's a cool dynamic, the uh, Planner family and that whole deal, and. I'm excited, like I say, to see other characters of significance, like Ivy, who seems to be like she's going to be a character of significance, so I'm excited for her. And of course, again, at some point down the line, Sasha and Marcy will likely be characters of significance. In fact, they definitely will be characters of significance, there's no doubt in my mind, and I can't wait to see where that goes. But um, a lot of fun stuff all around there. And I'm definitely looking forward to more and just generally being consistent. Like I said, you guys are getting lots of fun stuff. If you haven't been following the channel. If you're uh, if you're a fan of Attack on Titan, my Attack on Titan reactions will be returning are are, are going on every uh, should be going on every Monday, um, and now starting now. So on you know the next Monday will be the first a video for season four part two, and I'll uh, keep posting Attack on Titan reactions on Mondays until we. Uh, until uh, the series ends, or if there's any breaks, or whatever the deal is, we will uh, keep posting Season 4 reactions, which should be really fun, and uh, that'll be a thing on Mondays. We obviously have Monogatsuri going on. Um, the next Rick and Morty video will be the final Rick and Morty video of Season 5, you know, of 2, but uh, after that we'll have a new Western series in the other sl Western slot, uh, slot 2, obviously this is slot 4. Uh, we got My Hero's got a fair few videos left, but even that's probably only going to be a month, month and a half or so before we're through that and on to another new anime. Um, and then, of course, like I said, we're, gr we're still grinding JoJo's. That's not going to finish anytime soon, but, you know, we're grinding that currently in part four. And, uh, yeah, like I said, we got Monogatari going on, and we're going to be getting to Madoka Magica. We should be getting to Madoka Magica next month in February, so that's exciting. So yeah, I mean, we got we got some fun stuff coming. We got a new Western series coming later this month, Madoka in February. Um, February should also probably be when the My Hero Replacement show starts, which is an unannounced series as well. So, uh, you know, we'll have some new stuff in slots one to three. Not too long. We're going to be on Amphibia a while. There's quite a few episodes of Amphibia, so it's going to take a while to get through it, especially since we're, you know, just scratching the surface. We're not even halfway through season one yet, although... 
Video wise, we are because we will be finishing season one and three more videos. So the next video is only going to be eight to ten, but then you're going to get the big boys, the big chunky ep uh, chunky videos for Amphibia uh, to, to finish season one. So that'll be really fun to dive into larger helpings of Amphibia. Um, really excited for that. But I'm really just excited for everything that's going on with the show. Like I said, if you guys want to support the channel, check out the Patreon down below in the description. You can vote on monthly movie polls, fun stuff like that. You can also check out uh, my um, Discord server if you want to hang out there and all that fun stuff. But anyways, Flame and Jerk signing out. Hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastical day. And I'll see you next time with another video. Thanks for watching. Peace.